Okay, we're up to the Mishnah on Chaf Vav Amid Beis. Chaf Vav Amid Beis. New sugya, but, uh, but very much what we've been talking about until now. A woman who is in prison. This is not Shvuya. Shvuya is one, one who's captured in battle and, as, and enslaved. This is not a slave. This is someone who's in prison. Now, if their imprisonment is because of monetary matters, then Muteris Labaila, she still be permitted to her husband. Uh, however, if she's in prison because of capital punishment, then Asur Labaila. Now, who is the Bailo over here? Let's see Rashi. Muteris Labaila. They're scared to go ahead and, and take a monetary loss. They're not mafkar. In other words, since she's worth money to them, so therefore they won't treat, treat her in a, in a derogatory way, and therefore she's mutter to her husband. However, if she's imprisoned, that means she was judged. She's on death row. She was judged for Misa. Then Asur Labayla. The Hoyl V'noigin Boy Hefker since they're noig by Hefka, she's going to be killed anyway. That maybe, perhaps, she willingly lived with one of them. In other words, Rashi's learning, guys. It's not going on a Kayim. I would have learned Stamazoi. I would have learned Asul Abayla. It's speaking of the Kayim because she was forced. Because a, a, bas, a nation's Kayim, who's an Anusa, is Asa. Rashi's not learning that way. Rashi's learning that she would willingly go ahead and, and, and acquiesce to uh, to uh, to the the, the the guy, and therefore, and this gets into the shaila that we had earlier in the Masech, the fellas. Remember why would they? Why did they make the gezera that they should go ahead and get married on Tuesday? Because the hegmon would come and be boil and and, and oh, So then we said, so teach them that it's okay, teach them that it's okay, and said there's maybe some the the prutzais. So lechayrik, it would go into that. Let's see a little tosfos over here. Stop trying to save themselves. That's the yeah, yeah, and again, yeah, of course. The bottom tesis. This is even to her, her husband. That's a Jew, meaning uh, not a, not a kohen. The In other words, she would go ahead and acquiesce because hopefully, what they would then not, not kill her. Then they would not kill her. Yehuda were at nine. Then 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 they would not go ahead and. And kill her. The ila baila kain kamar basura shemen enasa. And if the shaila is that what maybe the the, the husband is a kain, and we're worried about force, right? In kain havile lemeima asur lekuna. The gemara should have said that the gemara should have said asur lebaila. It should say asur lekuna. Elavade afilu lebaila yisrael asura. Right? Afilu lebaila yisrael is also good. Now let's go back in time. Guys, a woman, a man and his uh and this is what day? Wednesday. Good. Why? She may show time is Basulim, Hishkim, and you go to Bezin on Thursday. Right. And Bizman of, of the Bizman of, of the Bizman of Sakana, then watch get married on Tuesday. What's the Sakana? That the Hegman would come and they would kill themselves. So in time our Fetoisis, Snuas Lishteru, let the Snuas be permitted to their husbands. The Koidin Lochain Masun of Shayu. Because before they, they got married on on, on, on on Tuesdays, before they sw- went off, they'd be Moisa Nefesh, Kidamash Bresh Mechilton, as we discussed at, uh, uh, in, on Gimel Amid Beis. Gabi Kola Nisis Brevi, Tibol La Hegmon, La Sar, the Chila, the Tsarach Lai. So now it's Greg Tyson Akasha. Why are we making a cop on statement? Every single woman is asked to her husband. We see that what? That the woman would really die rather than willingly acquiesce to somebody, right? So therefore, it's achas We have to be chayes in everyone. Maybe they're not at snua. But feel nearest snua shema eina. She pairs at snua not very doichy tikateres. Very doichy tikateres saying, well, maybe in this case. Just, again, just food for thought. There are rishonim that learn that it's only going on a kaye. Tosis agrees with Rashi over here. It's going asur lebaila means everybody. But be aware there are there are opinions that this asura means. To her husband, that's a kayin, and then Afkamina would be she's also a kayin because even if she doesn't acquiesce, if she's raped, that's it. Over here, we're worried about her acquiescing and thus being willingly with what with the with the, with the husband. Okay, says with the guy. Amar Rav Shmuel Bar Yitzchak. Let's qualify the Mishnah. Amar Rav says Rav Shmuel Bar Yitzchak in the name of Rav. Loi shonu that by mom and she's muta. Again, mom and Rashi brought 
by money, we're not, we're cons- they're, they're not going to go ahead and mess up their investment. In other words, she's worth money to them, so they're not going to go ahead and treat her like an hefka dika way. Leishanu, that they won't treat her in a hefka dika way. El sheyad Yisrael tekifa alev dika chafim. That's when when the yidden are in first place. When we're, we're stronger, then the goyim are what are not in, not running the, the society. Avliyad dika chafim tekifa latzman. I feel like they mamen asur lebaila. If the goyim are stronger, then even that situation, if the law is going to be with them, so they'll be mafkir a woman, and they're not worried about it. So. But Rab is qualifying the Mishnah, the dinner of the Mishnah, that if she is if she's being held in prison because of monetary reasons, that's only if the Jews are in first place. But if, if not, if the Goyim are, are ruling, then what? Then no. Then even then, we're, we're concerned that what? She, they will they will be mafkar. What's if Rav? Rav is going to ask on this din. Hey, Rav Yosi Akoyin, the Mesech the Idiyas. Hey, Rav Yosi Akoyin, Rav Zechari Ben Akatsav. Interesting, Akatsav is usually a butcher. So Ben, ben Akatsav, Abbas Yisrael, Shehur Harna Ba'ashkalayin. Listen, to her, what does Hawana mean? Mm-hmm. Rashi says, Nis mashachna. She was a mashkin. She was a mashkin. If someone defaults on the loan, she gave herself over to the Goyim. She's the prize. Can you imagine Leilenu? So there was an incident with a Jewish girl. It's funny. In, in, um, in the Mishnah, I looked at the Mishnah, it says Tinoikis. It says, it doesn't say Tinoikis here. In the Mishnah, it says Tinoikis, a young child. But there was a, a girl, Shahur Harna, which she was, Ashkelon, which is, was a, a town. She was from Mishpacha of Kahanim, and when she was let loose, they Marachika. In other words, they, they did not allow her to go ahead and marry into the Mishpacha because they were concerned that what in fact she had been violated. The Eidaha Meidim I saw, however, Aidim testified on her, Nistara, she was never behind closed door with a man, with Shlainit Ma, and the male, she was not what? She was not violated. Okay? And nonetheless, they were rachek, but you had edim, edim, they edim, they need, they edim. The amru lehem chachamim. One second, the chacham told the mishpacha of this young girl, im atem aminim shahur harna. If you believe that she was made a mashkin, haminu shleim nistro shleim ma. Then you got to believe that what that neither was she um, behind closed doors or violated. Then e atem aminim shleim nistara. And if you don't believe them shleim ma, al taminu shahur harna. Right. In other words, maman of shach, you should not go ahead what and Distance yourself from this girl. There's nothing, there's no reason to distance yourself from this girl. There's Adis, and if you got to play both ways. If there's Adis that she was capped, that she was made a mashkin, there's Adis that she wasn't violated. And if you don't believe that she was, wasn't violated, then you can't believe that she was made a mashkin. The man of Shah says, Ashkelon was a place where the Goyim were in charge. The Kitani, her harnu in, Dafka, if she was made a mashkin, you have to worry. But but if she's in prison, not. So we're questioning Rav. You said Rav, if the Goyim are in first place, then even if she's captured uh, in prison because of money, she you're that she was violated. You see over here, you only chayshed she was violated because she was what made into a mashkin. In other words, if she's made into a mashkin, it's not. She's asking for it, right? She's mamish, This is what she's here for. Masha Enkain, if she was in prison, not. Kasha and Rav who said in prison when Goyim are in first place, it's still violated. And for the Gemara, no. Who I didn't, I feel in Nechbasha. The same thing would apply even if she was in prison. It, it, she would be considered what? Uh, uh, the mommin, she'd be okay if you had Adim. Well, and if you don't have Adim, and she would also, so in other words, she'd be considered violated. Not only if she was a mashkon, but even if she was what? In, uh, in prison. And it was an Ashkelon, and they weren't Adim, we would say that what she's us. Uh, so, so why does it say, why did it say that for Arna? says, no, my Sushaya Guys, this isn't a psak based upon a question asked. This was, a, in fact, a case that happened. This happened to be the case. You're not limited to the fact she was a Mashkin. That happened to be the Mitzias of the case. But in fact, if she had been captured, who I think she would be violated? Why? Even though it's a, a monetary matter, nonetheless, since the Goyim are ruling that area, then we Rob's din would be in place. Okay, we're going to have the same Gemara. First, we asked it as a Kasha. Now we're going to bring it with a Raya, and then we're going to ask the same Gemara as a Stira. And we can all end up in the same place. The bottom line is when it's Dine Mominus, it's, and, and you said that, watch, she's not violated, it's only when the Yidn are in first place. If the Goyim are ruling, then even Mammon, then even Mammon, you would go ahead and say what that that she she was violated. 
Okay, now we're going to bring it as a proof. Here was a kasha, same Gemara with an H to be a proof. We're in Chavzayin Amir Aleph. Chavzayin Amir Aleph, we are two lines down. Ikadi Amri, Chavzayin Amir Aleph. Ikadi Amri, Amar Rava, Afanan Ami Tanina. We also learned Rav's din. Rav's din. Again, what's Rav's din? If the guy, this din of Mammon is only made the Yidna in the first place, but if the guy, not. Hey, Rav Yosi Akoye and Rav Zachary Ben Akatsav, Albas Yisroel, Shavur Harna Ba Ashkelon, she was a Mashkin in Ashkelon, Virichkuha Bene Mishpachta, and her Mishpacha distant from her. It was a Mishpacha of Kahanim, and they said, she, You can't marry you, and you're a Zaina, you were violated. You know what? If you believe that she was a mashkon, right? So in other words, you can't play the Aiden Palgina di Bura to Asaha. If you believe one thing, you got to believe the other thing. Ah, now, Fred the Gemara now brings the Gemara a proof. Ashkelon the Al Yidei Momin who was. The town of Ashkelon was a mominous Nikodin. She was a mashkin. The taima and the reason why she is permitted, the Edim Edim Asa. Her ain Edim Edim Asa loy. But if Edim would not have testified, she would be violated. In other words, Nechbeshes and Hurharno are the same. Right now, we're holding the same thing. The reason why she'd be permitted is because they're Edim. If there were no Edim, let's go two things. Is this a monetary matter? Mm -hmm. Yes. Is it a town that 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 multitude of goyim? Yes. Yes. The town multitude of goyim. Yeah. So now, what do you see? The reason she's off the hook, Adam. Without Adam, she'd be violated. Rav's din. That's Rav's din. The din of moment that you're off the hook is only in a Jewish town, but a goyish town not. So it's a luchayra. Now it's a proof. What's the obvious? Not more. Not proof. No, that's only by mashkin. It's not by nechbeshes. Says the Gemara, no, you don't have a proof. My my love, loishna her hand of loishna nech b'sha, and therefore what you have a proof that terav's din that if it's edim and it's the goyim uh, in first place, then what then? Then she will be asa. Loy her hand is shiny. The hand is different, but in achinami nech b'shes, even though the goyim are ruling, it, if nech b'shes, they're not going to violate her. They'd want to keep their 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 their, their, their investment. Now, so th therefore, we had it as a kasha, we had it as a proof, and now we're going to have it as a stira. Okay, and the ikid the romula mirma that those who had this dialogue, you know, with the stira. Nice gemara because it's all the same pair. Ikid the romula mirma the those who asked it as a stira. The tat tanan al yidei momin muteris lebaila. The Mishnah says if she was being imprisoned and held because of money, she's muttered to her husband. Uriminu alias she was stira. Hey, Rabbi Yosi. Rabbi Yossi testifies that what the same thing, the cooler means the whole case, what happened in Ashkelon. Iva, Ashkelon, Dayude Momin. Ashkelon was a monetary matter. She was imprisoned by because she was uh, not prison, she was held as a mashkin. The Katani Taima, the Edema Edema, I saw. But Ain Edema Edema, I saw Loy. But Edem did not go ahead and testify, then not. So, what do you see? So, you see that again in general. That if there were no adim and it's a monetary matter, that what then it should be usher. She would be usher. Again, guys, one more time. Our Mishnah says, our Mishnah says that in, in the town of Ash, our Mishnah says, any mominess, you're good. You're, she's mutter to her husband. Fred the Gemara from this case, the reason she's mutter to her husband is only because of adim. Mashmah, there were no Adim, she'd be also to her husband. So we have to get a contradiction to the Mishnah. Without Rav's din, guys, without Rav's din, in the first Lashin, it was a Kasha on Rav. In the second Lashin, it was a proof to Rav. In this Lashin, Rav is not here at all. We're asking it as a stira. One more time. Rav went ahead to qualify the Mishnah. Our Mishnah said, Mumin, she's not violated. Rav says that's only if Jews are in first place, but Goyim, she's violated. Fred the Gemara from the Maisa, even Goyim, she's what? She is, she's violated. We had either two, we had Pshatim, that there's a difference between uh, being a Mashkin, like the case of Ashkelon, and 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 uh, and, the, and being captured, and, and being held in prison. Good. Now we're asking it without Rav, a simple stira. Our Mishnah says a din. What's the din? If a woman's in prison for money, she's mutter to her husband. Fred the Gemara, 
you see over here, the reason why in Ashkelon she was permitted to, to, to a husband is because they were Adem. But if they weren't Adem, you won't be permitted. Mashma Mammon, you're not permitted. Oh. Now, we didn't say anything about Rav at all. Good. So says the Gemara, I'll give you, now let me answer your Stila. I have Ashkelon that they Mammon, but the tiny time of the Adem, Adem, I saw. I ain't Adem, Adem, I saw. Loi. Well, Mishani, and the Gemara answers, I'm a Rav Shmuel, but Rav Yitzchak, Loi Kasha. Kan sheyad Yisrael tekifa aloy bdekechavim. Kan sheyad aloy bdekechavim tekifa laatzman. You want to hear the difference? Our mission is talking what where the Jews are in first place. In that case, in Ashkelon, the, the guy were in first place, and that's the difference. Then up in Ami, and in other words, and Memela Rav's din. Rav didn't say it, but Memela that is Rav's din. Very good shmuel. Al yidei nefasha is asura. We said if she's being held for what for 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 capital punishment, she's asa. Because again, she may go ahead and willingly to save a life, according to Taisvis, to go ahead and be with the Goyim. Says the Gemara, I'm a rab, kigoyin, neshei ginve. What are we speaking about? Neshei of Ganovim. Since the, the, the Baal are Ganovim, right? Mm -hmm. And, right? The, and uh, but, but what they would do is they would go ahead and they would hang the husbands, and they, the Malchus then would be mafka, their daughters and their, and their wives. Belevi, I'm going, ishtoy shel ben Dunai. It's the wife of a murderer, Ben Dunai. No, it's not, 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 you know, it's just thievery, not. But a guy, Ben Dunai, I know what Dunai did. I always wonder, Michael Ben Jusai, what did Jusai do to be Zaycha to get into the Gemara? He was a bandit. Dunai is a murderer. What, what did he do to get into the, the Gemara? But he's there. Anyway, so, Omer Chizkiah, but who shenig Mardin al Hariga? There has to be a Gemara Din in order, the only Mafka, if there was a Gemara Din for Hariga. Rabbi Yechon Amar Afbi, Shlenig Mardin, Hariga, if she's being held for capital punishment. Even if there's not a Gemar Din, right? But 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 according to the Slushin, the wives of Ganov and Knight, the only the wives of murderers or herself being a murderer, then they'd be not for that. Right, right. But is this a small thing can I ask? Yeah. When the Gemara first let me, let me let me ask, let me ask Benji. What the score is? Okay. What's the, what's the score? <laughs> okay, Benji, yes. I don't know. Okay, yes. the first time they bring down this memory about the Jews being in charge or the, or the guy being in charge, they, they it's quoted from Rashmul uh, Rav Yitzchak Amarav. This time, in this when this third go round, it doesn't mention Rav. They don't say the same Rav. Did you hear what I how I explained the Gemara? Yeah, yeah, I understand, the, but. but the Gemara, the this Gemara was a steer. It wasn't, was, wasn't Rob's memory at all. It wasn't Rob's but, memory at all. It's the same It's the same memory, though, but it just doesn't, doesn't mention the same people. Okay, okay. Right there. Anyway. I, said it was, I said it was a small thing. <laughs> okay, Bea. You learned very well, the Shabbos. Says, says the Mishnah. Ear shekivshua karchum, an ear that is 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 kivshua was captured karchum by a siege. Here's what I think it means. I mean, I, I kind of know what it means. I'm trying to fit it in the words. They conquered the city, and then they they sieged the city. In other words, they conquered the city and they they surrounded the city. It wasn't like a, a, they conquered and kept on going. They conquered and they stayed. Good. So now. Call Kahanois, all the Kahanois, meaning wives of Kahanim, Shenimsu Besoycha Psulais. They're all puzzled. In other words, they're all, we're all Chayish that they were violated by the Goyim, by this army, and they have a puzzle. Vim Yeshlohem Edim, and if there are Edim, that they were what? They were <clears throat> not violated. Afilu Eved, Afilu Shifcha, even people who are normally puzzled Edis, like an Eved or Shifcha, Hari Elu Nehemonim. Then they are believed. Good. However, they won't be believed to say themselves that they were what? That they were not violated. So, a Metsias of a case, you have an army surrounding the city, and they, they capture the city, and they are sieging the city, and now, though any Aishas Kayane is in Becheskes, that she's possible. However, if you have any, 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 any proof, even Adis of a non, an Eid and even not even a, a kosher aid, even an Evid Veshivcha, it would be okay to get her off the hook. And but won't be believed by the Ashram. That's our Mishnah. Uriminu, Alessio Estiva. Beleshes. 
Boleshes is Rashi says is Chayel Al Shem, and they call Boleshes Shem Echap Shem Kol Hamet Moinim. They're looking for every hidden thing. These are, this is an army that's uh, they're plundering, and they're so they call Boleshes. Rav Kivayga brings that it says. Remember when when uh, Lavan went looking for the Trophim? When Lavan looked for the Trophim, the Tigim on, on the word Vayachpesh is a Balash. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so the Boleshes, the Rav Kivayga is the case. Telling you, you know. We all remember that when we were trying to make a target, right? Anyway, so, so that, so the, the, now they come to a city, b'shashalayim. If it's not, if they're just, you know, they're not killing anybody, they're marauding. They just want money. Chovias pesuchais asurais, chovias that are open are asa. They menasech the wine. Stumais mutarais, and stumais and mutarais, right? However, b'shas melchama elu elu mutarais. They're both mutter. If you shain penai lenasech, they don't have time to go ahead and be menasech. So who are din? They don't have time to be ma'anis a woman. So you have a kasha. You're telling me an army automatically the psulais we see over here not. So I'm a rav mori libol yesh penai lenasech ain't penai. When it comes to this nus that they have time for, when it comes to nesach that they, that they don't have time for. Look, there's a gemara that says the whole reason they for avoid the zara is to matter is nus. Uh, yeah, the only reason, the whole point of avoid the zara is, is the matzness. It's like a state. Rav Yitzchak bar Alaza mishmei dechis yamar kan becharkum shel oisam malchus kan becharkum shel malchus acheres. Now, if it's the charkum of their malchus, we have machlokes here. Rashi and Tosfos. Rashi says it's the charkum of their malchus. They're not going to go ahead and violate the, the citizens of the city. In other words, they're there. It's, it's being sieged by what? By the, 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 their, their own. So they're not going to go ahead and violate. Mashenkin, if it's another Malchus, they'll violate. So the Stira, the Beleshes, and the Mish, Amish is speaking about what? It's speaking about the Malchus of, an, of another city, of another kingdom. And this is the Beleshes is speaking about what? It's speaking about one of the oh, same. Taisa says the opposite. Taisa says if it's they're the same, then they're more better after more assured of themselves. They'll be mizana. They'll be violate mashink, and the other one they, they, they're not secure, so they're gonna run away. So either way, but that's but that's the terrorist. The okay, question is which one is which? Says Gemara Malchus Nami Efshad Loi Orik Chad Minayu. Now you're telling me our Mishnah that they're gonna be safe if there's Adas, good. And if there's so the, the, the city is sieged, isn't it possible that one person came through and was and and was violated? Some of you who Shmuel, we're speaking about where the guards can see each other, the ones who are guarding the city. That's why I was mocking them, guys, that they're guards surrounding the city, they're sieging the city to make sure that everything is okay in the city. You know, martial law, yes, martial law makes sure makes so everything is okay. And so they're surrounding the city and they can see each other, so you can be assured no one's going to get through. One of the guards will fall asleep and some will get through. Says the they surrounded the city shulshulta with chains, the kalba dogs, the gabza and geese. Uh, the gabza is like thorns, the abza and and geese. In other words, they have an alarm system. There's an old alarm system. So if someone sneaks in, they're gonna hear the chains rattling and the geese quacking and the dogs barking and the men. Since they step on the thorns, they're not gonna be in a gishmaka matzit. Omra of Abba Varsav, the Pligibra of Yehuda Nasiya of Rabbana. Again, Rabbi Yehuda Nasiya, guys, is the grandson of Rabbi, Rabbi Yehuda Nasi. And then there was his son, Rabbi Gamliel, and his son was Rabbi Yehuda Nasiya. So we have a chloikas between Rabbi Yehuda Nasiya and Rabbana. Chad Omer, Kan Becharkam Shal Oysa Malchus, Kan Becharkam Shal Machus Acheres, Vlay Kasha, Lay, and he had Vlay Midi, and he had no Kasha whatsoever, because he wasn't concerned that anyone would enter the city, right? The Chad Kasha Lay Kalhani. And one was concerned that a person would enter the city. In other words, the same kasha. One, and, and in other words, the city that let's let's go to Rashi's Peshad. If it's your own malchus, you're safe. I worrying worrying about someone's going to get through. They didn't hold that for a kasha. One did hold it for a kasha, and the one that held it for a kasha, we had the same security system in place to ensure that what that everything would be okay. If you have a hiding place, Matzelis al Hakahenis Kulan. They'll go ahead with Misaimif that she's going to find the, the hiding place. 
and she would avoid being violated, and then they'd be mutter. Boy, Rav Yemya, Eina Machzekes Ela Achas Mahu. What happens is hiding place only holds place for one. Mi Aminon Kolchad Vechad Ahaynu Ha. Do we say that each one of the girls is the one that hid there and should be mutter? I know it's a suffix, but we'll say that's the one. We don't say. It. So that's the Shaila. Very famous Gemara. You have two Shvilin, two roads. On one of the roads, guys, there's a mace, and it's not possible to get past that road without contracting Tuma. And the other road, what is, is clean, but you don't know which one you went down. So now, we just, we just come on Tahar. One of the roads is Tame, one of the roads is Tahar. And they go on one of the roads, the Osa Tahiris, and then consequently they 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 are involved with Tyros. And his friend goes on the other road and we also Tyrus. So Zicha, one of them is Tame, but it, the suffix, which one it is. This road is in Rishus Arabim. What's our rule of thumb? Suffix Tuma Rishus Arabim, Sveikai Tahar. Good, very good. Rav Yehuda Oimer, Im Nishal If each one is separately, Tahiris, we'll say the Tahar, Suffix Tuma Rishus Arabim. Shneim Ka'achas, if they ask it at once, at the same time, Tameis. If you see, I'm a Benkach or Benkach, whether they ask, Simultaneously or separately, Tameyan. So even Rabbi Rabbi Yosi, in other words, Rabbi Yochanan is explaining the machloikas between Rabbi Yosi and Rabbi Yehuda, and he's saying he's qualifying. Rabbi Yosi said, "Ben kach or ben kach that yitame." What does it mean? It means if they go ahead and they ask separately, then they will be tahar. They ask together Tameyan. Like Nechaku, where's the machloikis between Rabbi Yehuda and Rabbi Yaisi? They're coming to ask about themselves and their friend. Rabbi Yaisi compares it to Vasachas. And Rabbi Yehuda says, compares it to one after the other. Since, what, since you're permitting all of them, it's to be considered Vasachas. Like they all come, you're saying that they were all in this. In, in, you're asking a Shaila, you're coming to go ahead and pass in on all of them, right? So it's like they're all asking at the same time what were the Tommy or not. We pass in this is the way Rashi learns, we pass in like Rabbi Yossi. So since they're coming to ask the, on them and, and their friends, it's a Madame of Vasachas, Rabbi Yossi says it's Tameya. So let's be Pesh the Shaila. You want to know if, if, if they're Tameya Tar, they're Tameya. So it's the Gemara Hachi Hashta. Hassam by the road. Vada Ikatuma. By the road, the Vada is Tuma. How do you know anyone was Tame? It's only a suffix. In other words, it's it's a bigger suffix because you don't have to say Tuma at all. Therefore, you can't be Paisha the Shaila from uh, from Shneshvila. Boy Ravashi. Umra, she says, Loinich Basi, Loinin Macy. You know, I didn't hide and I wasn't violated. In other words, the case where there was a hiding place. And she says, I didn't hide, but I wasn't violated. Mahu. Mi amrinon on the base. Mi amrinon mali l'shaker. Do we say she has a migu? Oy dilma loy amrinon. What's the mali l'shaker? Believe me that I was was not violated. Maybe I could have said I hid. I have to barvon. What's the difference? Why was pesha asa pesha hitta? Because there's no pesha asa over here because we know the city was was surrounded. No pesha. No, you have to make the distinction between a pesha asa. Pesha means we don't not we know zero guys right. We know zero. How do we find out? Only through her. Through we have, we don't need her to tell us that that the situation here is one of possible violation. We know. So the only shiler is is the kaya chataina. What's the taina? What's the taina? Right. The taina is believe me that I was that I, I did not hide and I wasn't violated. Maybe I could have said I hid, and then you would have believed me. Says the Gemara. Umay shnam ehu maisa tahu gavra the following incident. There was this individual, the Ogale Khamra Lukhavre. He rented a donkey to his friend. And Amale, and he told him the following. He's a renter. He said, Listen, do not go the way of Nahar Pocket, the river of Pocket, the Ikamaya, because there's a lot of water there. Uh, the, the, I think the Gemara says, and the, as a result, the Avir is not healthy, or or it's a difficult for the it's a it's a difficult for, for, for an animal. So I don't want you going there. Zil borcha de narish, the lekamaya. Go the way of narish lekamaya. Notice wherever he is going to, you can go one of two ways. You can go the nahar pocket or you go narish. 
I'm renting you that you should go through Narish. I'm, I don't want you to go to Narish pocket because of water. Now, why did the guy do, of course? For us, the work in our pocket. And he, he went, Umeis, Hamra, and the Hamra died. So why would you say? He's the Chachayev, right? Asla Kamei the Rava, Amalei, in. The guy said, it's true. Be'uchad in our pocket, Asli. I went not in our pocket. Mi'u, loy havi maya. There wasn't any water. So Amar Rava, Rava said, Amar Rava, Mali l'shaker. He has a migu. I boy Amalei, be'uchad in the Narish Asl. I went, believe me, that I went in our, in our pocket and there was no water, maybe I could have said, I went what? And, and Okay, so the same thing over here. Believe me, I wasn't violated. Maybe I could have said I hid. So if I'm a buyer, I said, Mali l'shaka, b'maka meidun le'am limam. In other words, Mali l'shaka, we don't say. So in other words, where do we, we have Aiden that what? We have Aiden that in our pocket there's always water. Bukhar, we have Aiden over here that what? That that there are violators. So the Gemara wants to say, "Pom Rabbi, a mali l'shakim makamid le'aminam." Hachi hashda. It's not a good sushtel. Hasam vada yike Aiden the yike Maya. There's Aiden that there was water there by Nahar pocket. Hacha vada itma. There's no vada that she was violated. Chashashahu. It's only chashash. B'makam chashash and minon. Therefore, she be believed. You know, it's just a you say the migu guys. Migu b'makam Aiden le'am minon. Guys, the koyach atayna migu does not work with makam Aiden. There's a shach at the end of Chesh Mishpat. I, I forgot the simon. Goes through all the migus where, where you say where you don't say it. But here you see when you say the migu, you say migu. You don't say migu makam edim. You do say migu makam shash. Okay, so so far good. In yesh edim, afilu eved, afilu shichan emonim. Okay, so what do we what do we have, guys? What do we have? We said that if she's possible the kahuna. However, if there was edus that we usually don't accept. That she was not behind closed doors or violated, we believe them. Mashma vafilu shifcha dida nehimna. Mashma any shifcha, even her own shifcha. So here's the question: Do we believe her own shifcha or not? Says the Gemara. Mino es yistiru. It's a Mishnah in 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 a gittin. There's something cool guys call the get yashan. If a guy writes to get to his wife and then he's behind closed doors with his wife, the get's not good. So here we have a case of a shkavira writing a get to his wife and then he's behind closed doors with his wife. So now, like to siachet imoi, she after the get is written, she should not be yachet with him. Ella al pi edim, only edim. If the edim there, then it's okay. But filu al pi eved, al pi shivcha, chutz mi shivcha sa, because not her shivcha. If they shaliba gas for shivcha sa, she's so accustomed to a shivcha, she would even go ahead and 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 live with her husband in front of the shivcha. In other words, so her shivcha is not believed. We don't trust her. So Fred the Gemara, why in Gittin we do not trust her, yet over here to say she wasn't violated in the city, we are trusting her. We have a we have a, a Shaila. It just said, it just said Evan over here and Shifcha, the assumption being that it could be her Shifcha as well. Question from Agamara to the Mishnah in Gittin. Why in Gittin is not a Shifcha, a Shifcha is not believed, not yet over here in Amasechta, the Shifcha, her Shifcha is believed. So I'm Rav Papi, Bishfuya Kilu. In other words, usually Shifcha is not believed. By Shvuya we make them. Since it's a chashash, by Shvuya we saw earlier, by Nerechad is believed by, by, by what? Is believed by Trey. So it's a big chashash. So therefore, we will make them. Rafabi says we'll make them. That's Rav Papi. Rav Papa Omar, ha, the Mishnah in Gittin, the Shifcha Dida is speaking about her Shifcha. Ha, over here by us, the Shivcha Dide is speaking about his Shivcha. Right? It, when it said, it just said Shivcha. We assume when it said Shivcha, it meant what? Any Shivcha. We're, we're qualifying it. Says Rav Papa, no. It means his Shivcha. But Enoch Inami, her Shivcha would not be believed. And we're consistent now. The Mishnah in Gittin and the Mishnah in Subis. In both cases, the her Shivcha is not believed. In both cases, says the Gemara, "V'shif the didah loy mehimna hakatani ain other meir al atzmai mashma the last the last clause of the Mishnah a person can be made on themselves hashif the didah mehimna right mashma hashifcha is so we're asking from an inference and for the Gemara shifcha is an ami katzma hashifcha is like a self dummy so two terutzim guys kasha let's wake up two, two kasha terutz our Mishnah 
Masma Hashifcha, any Shifcha, including Hashifcha, believe. Gitten, not believe. Two to Rutsim, one, right? One, Rapapis Teretz, Shvuya Wemeko, Rapapis Teretz, Amishna speaking about his Shifcha, not Hashifcha. Hashifcha that won't be believed. Says the Gemara, Ravashi Yama, third Teretz to the Stira, Ravashi Yama, Hova Hova Shifcha Dida. Ah, they're both speaking about Shifcha Dida. They're both speaking about Shifcha Dida. The shivcha michsei chazia v'shaska. You know what a shivcha does? She sees and she's quiet. She sees and she's quiet. So now, by get, do we want her to be quiet or open her mouth? We want her to open her mouth and say what? We want to we want to say that she didn't, right? Over here, what do we want? What? what, what over here, over here, we, we over here. Let's see. Says the Gemara. Haba haba shivcha dida. The shivcha michsei chazia v'shaska. Hasam by get, dishti kasam matirasa, that her shtika will mata her, saying nothing happened, like him that she's not believed. In other words, we want her to say it, she doesn't say. Hacha, dishti kasa israsa, if she's quiet, it's going to ask her, mehimna. In other words, the fact that she opened her mouth, we believe her. Guys, outside. What a shifka does is quite, it remains silent. So in other words, Rashi is going to the, the psychology of the matter. Here you have in Gittin, we, if she had remained silent, if she would have remained silent, then that would have matted the, the woman. The get would have been a good get. So the fact that she goes ahead and opens the mouth, and, and did I say that correctly? Yeah. In get, being quiet will matter her. So therefore, when she's quiet, we don't believe her. Because she's doing... In other words, she's doing what a shifcha does. They remain silent. In other words, we would have to, she would have to say, and get, no, they did have relations. But she's not going to do that. So therefore, we don't believe her. Over here, her tev is to be silent. But you know what she's doing? She's testifying. She's saying something. Therefore, we believe her. Over here, silence would ask her. We'd assume she was violated. But she's going against the base of a shifcha and remain silent by testifying. So therefore, we'll believe her. Fred Gemara, Hashta Nami Isya Umashakra, that maybe now she'll lie. Says the Gemara, no. Tarti lay of the two things she won't do. First, to remain silent, to remain silent if a Giverit had done something, had be a, and two, to lie and say she didn't, that we know. Those, those are two steps. Those are two steps. To say again, to remain silent that, that if a Giverit did do something, and to lie, that we won't do. Says the Gemara, right. So Mori Bar Isik's or Chana Bar Isik's brother showed up from Chuzai, and what happened was the father died, and Mori is holding on to the property. Mori is holding on to the property, and now this guy says, "Amalei polig mi benichse daba." Hey, give me a piece of the action of daddy. Amalei said, "Mori lo yedan lecha." I don't know who you are. I, I don't know who you are. Also, the commander of Chista, Amalei, Shabbat Kamalach. It's very good that he doesn't recognize you. Bichsev, Bayaka Yosef Esachov, the Heim Loi Kiruhu, Malamit Shiyotze Bloi Chasim Bezakein, Ubabachim Bezakein. He grew a beard. So you see that, what, that, you know, if he's believed to say he don't recognize you. Amalei, so said Rav Chista to Zil Asi Sadei, the Achva'a. So go ahead, bring the bride. Bring Adim. Since he says he doesn't know you are, go. You want to be Maitzi Mechaveroi? Bring Adim that what that that you're his brother. Amale. So this brother told Rav Kista, Isli Sade, I have Adim. However, Umistapu Mine, I'm scared of Mari. The Gavra Alamahu. He's a very strong guy. He's very intimidating. I, I can't bring the Adim. So Amale. So Rav Kista told Rami, the day he said to him, Zeal I sinu at. You go bring those Adim, the love Achuva, that he's not your brother. Amale said, Rami, Dina Hachi, I might say, I, I got to bring Ebraya. Amale said, Rav Chista, Hachi, the Ananalach, Ulekula Alami Chavarcha. This is the law, the way we rule, the Inalach, we rule for you and all your strong Chavra, that that are, are, are intimidated, that you have to bring a Raya. Hashtanami, Asi, Mashakri. So, why do we say two things? They'll come and they'll be intimidated and they'll lie. It says more tactically, obviously. To not come, they won't. But to come and lie, they won't. So there we say the same thing. Okay? Now, so we, we have 
machlekes by shifcha. We have three turetzim. Guys, outside. Outside. We have a stira. Our Mishnah says any shifcha is believed. Mashma, Mishnah Gittin says no. A shifcha is not believed. But Papi says that, that, that but Papi says that it's speaking over here, it's speaking about both shifkas. Why over here is believed? Because the Shvuya were maker. Said Rav Papa, our mission is speaking about what? Our mission is speaking about not hers. Hers is not believed. Hers is not believed, right? But it's speaking about his. His will be believed. Rav Ashi says, no, it's speaking about hers. And there's a difference when the, by get, her shtika is going to go ahead and, 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 and uh, her shtika is going to go ahead and get, get a, Make a mutter. We wanted to open a mouth so she did not believe. Over here, the fact that she cost her with Asaha, if she, the fact that she's opening up a mouth, goes ahead and gives them their monus. And if they're a clow, they remain silent. Okay, so now, says the Gemara, let's say this machloikis between, if the shift is them and this machloikis tanoyim. Zu edis, edis shvuya, ish vi isha, tina, this is speaking about edis of a captive woman, whether she was violated or not. Ish is believed, isha is believed, tina kachal is believed, tina kachal is believed, female is believed. Avia is believed. Ima is believed. Vachia, sister, Achaisa, brother, Achaisa, sister. Avaloi bina ubita, not her a daughter, not a, a son. Loi avada, not her servant, Bishop Chasa, not her male servant, not a, not a female servant. So Lachair is clearly what? A brysa that says her mates, a female servant is not believed. Vitanya idach, we have another brysa. Hakol neamonum lehayid, chutz mehimna, ubat mehemen, or baila, but herself and her husband. Now, so clearly what? This is even a sh shift would be believed. Now, the Rav Papi, the Rav Ashi, who said that what? They learned Pshad in the Mishnah to answer up. One is speaking about the Shriya Kilo, and one is speaking about what? The, depends on what we want to require, but it's speaking about hers. Tanoihi, clearly they have to learn it's Machlech's Tanoim. There's no Tzad that they can say that the Shifrop could possibly go ahead in Mata. Since they said that what? That you could they could testify either because of because of being Mako or because usually they remain silent, but th that's the reason they answered up. And since you have a, a Brysa that says a shift is not believed, how are they going to shine that Brysa? We have a Brysa saying a shifra is not believed. Rachel, Bitra, Katana, A, B, C. But they both said a shifra is believed. Rav Papi said a shifra is believed in Makam Shvuya, and Rav Ashi said it's believed in Mat because of the. It, the hate of in this case because she's opening her mouth rather than remaining silent. And here we have a Bryce that it says Ixnay on the Shifka A. Forget about it. It's gone, right? So clearly they're still stuck saying it's a Machlech Stanoyim. Now again, anyone gives a terrorist wants to come out with Kuli Alma. So this is, but Rav Papa, what did Rav Papa answer? Rav Papa answered, one second, she's not believed, but he, Amish is speaking about what? His. Uh, so snap, so Rav Papa, Rav Papi, Tanoyim. You know when what? When she's believed, if you hear him, then you'll be believed. That's in the town of Kartagia. Mishtoi speaking. They both question who said in front of who? Again, it was Messiah to be Tumoy. Again, that was just you're hearing it, they're not testifying. I and my mommy were captured. Right? When she went out to gather water, I was watching my mom. I went to lock it, ate some. My das was my mother. In other words, there wasn't a hersach das, but he's not testifying. And, and they heard them saying this. The Rebbe's court, the Shuvah Levi's court, the Asir, the Rebbe Yochanan, Alpiv, and and Rebbe Yochanan, Rebbe, the Asir, Rebbe Lekun Alpiv. So the Republic could say, ah, if it's Masir to be Tuma, you could believe what even Benah Bita. In this case, you you could believe. So in other words, this price, this was Loi Benah Bita, the Loi Shuv Chasa. That's regularly, but Masir to be Tuma, they would be believed. Thank you, Yehuda, for coming. 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 Thank you, Yehuda, for coming.